Welcome everyone to the Wait, hold on, hold on, Hayden. We've got a Discord server, and I think you should join it. It'll be, it'll be cool. Yeah, the link's in the description, so go join that. All right. Anyway. Right. So welcome to the last round of the RWB GT3 Championship on Race Room. Um, we set our first bank lap of a 48.9, and now we are following Brandon on our quickest, uh, yeah, our quickest lap. That's uh, been gone off. Um, yeah, so how was your qualifying after at this point? Um, I'm trying to remember, this was actually a couple of weeks ago that we drove the race. Um, now at this point, I mean, looking at the, the, the leaderboard at the top, I don't think I'd set a time yet. And from practice, I didn't think this track was going to be a strong track for Porsche, looking at all the the, the straights, and I thought the Mustang would be pretty strong here. Um, we, like we used this this race as like a tester, didn't we? Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna use this track as a bit of a. I mean, this uh, race is a bit of a test. We're gonna do a little bit of a different fuel strategy, but you'll see what happens later on. Um, yeah, I, I didn't think this was gonna be a strong track for us after practice. The car didn't feel that great, and it it's it's it was feeling all right in this session, but you'll see what times we do in a few corners time. So you've, oh, you you have set a time. You're uh, one point five seconds oh, ahead have, of me. Yeah, I have, I have set a time. It's is that first at this point? No, that's second. Okay. So, yeah. So this I, lap has been pretty eh at this point. Got a few off tracks, um, and I actually realised after qualifying, I had my brake balance completely wrong. All um, right. I had it too far forward and so I wasn't getting any other turn in I wanted yeah that would have held you back a wee bit so you see the time yeah that was only a tenth quicker so right so uh, a single race uh, this time just a yeah, standard one hour race um, and there is a mandatory pit stop uh, yeah. at some point during the race uh, I think I qualified second here yeah I'm um, Second on the line, Taha qualified first in the Audi. And I'm in eighth. Lights are out, and away we go. And Sam looks like doesn't he doesn't start. start. Um, that was close. <laughs> yeah, uh, I actually found out after the race that uh, he was so focused on trying to get a really good start that he, f he, f he just forgot to put him in, in first gear. So. Oh, that's a really <laughs> unfortunate start for him then. Yeah. Uh, so we are around alongside Madley here. Just being cautious into this corner. I want to have a, a a single my car in one piece. Yeah, um, yeah we got Roger right there. Yeah, he was eager to get past, but um, oh, here comes but, Sam with yeah, the Mustang, <laughs> the rocket ship. You um, think about it. No, he's he's being sensible there. I gave him a bit of room because um, I actually found it difficult uh, with the mirrors to know where they actually are. Yeah. Um, so, so at this point, I was just like, right, well, let's just keep Sam behind as much as possible. But I knew it wasn't going to last long because obviously he's at way higher top speed than the Porsche. Um, yeah. So still on getting a bit of a, a little bit of oversteer. Just looking behind at Sam. Can't make a move here. Yeah. I, I try to get the best exit possible. Yeah, the Porsche doesn't seem to have it, its top speed slightly better than the Audi, but its acceleration isn't that great. It's probably one of the lowest of all the cars. Is a cat covering from Sam pretty early there, and uh, coming into the last corners. This corner is like <laughs> the trickiest thing to get yeah, right. Yeah, the car wants to go all over the place. If you get your line wrong through there, that can put you off the track. It might sound no. funny, but like if you break too much through there, it throws you about. So yeah, well, that was Hayden's first lap. So now we're gonna see it again from my point of view. Just buzzing on the limiter there, and we're off. Now I I haven't been able to get a nice start in this vehicle um, at all. So I didn't get a jump Taha there. Uh, Jake got alongside me. I thought oh I might be able to get him back, but no he can. He can pull a lot better than my car can out the corner, and I just get swamped here. I think Rodas sneaks around the outside. All these cars seem to get a little bit more speed than me down the straight. 
I'll try to hold it tight, not touch him. I've got a bit of OST, that probably hurt my ex exit a little bit. At this point, I was I was a little disappointed, but I wasn't surprised. I sort of expected something like, like this to happen. Now, at this point, I was just hoping to keep up with them and wait for a mistake, potentially, so I could sneak through. Now, the top two are really pretty close, and we might see some battles from them. And then behind me, I don't think too far behind, was a couple of cars, and Hayden was one of them. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, and another thing that affected us, in, or affected me, in the last few races is this car doesn't really like a heavy fuel load. I've struggled quite a bit early race, it comes on late race, so... That's why we, uh, we, we tried this race as a, like a tester. We yeah. Actually, we underfueled the car by quite a lot. And, at, uh, the, at the start, we basically we we um we decided to go lower fuel at the start to potentially give us more pace at the start, and then we fueled up more in our pit stop. But usually we just um go full tank at the start, and at a tiny bit at our pit stop, and then go to the end. Okay, so we go to the last corner, still quite close to the front, which is all right. At least I hadn't fallen too far back yet. And now we go back to Hayden. Yeah, so he's still defending from uh, Sam. He's looking for a move around the outside of the next corner here. We defend. He's still there. And he's still there, and he pulls out of it right there. And that forced us to go wide and lose a bit of extra speed, but doesn't really matter. Uh, so here he comes again down the main straight. We defend from him. Alongside he's us at the right moment. right there. Yeah. A little bit of a squeeze out there, but we both survive. A little bit of a twitch at the end there. And then this, I just get masses amount of oversteer and that just allows me to get right around the outside here. I try yeah. to go for a counter move, but yeah. Not yeah, really, not really much I can do there. And then he takes off. You got to Go, his turn to battle is madly. Now back to me, um, this is probably a similar time, maybe a couple laps in. Um, the top four already bunched up. I was happy, I was I was confident that I, would, I was faster than these guys, but every time I got to a straight, they just pull away. Yeah, so that's uh, madly there, um, having one of those moments in that last corner. Back to me again, someone's gone a bit off track. I think this is the first uh, of the lapsed traffic that we got through, but he made it very easy, very easy for us to get through, which was nice. Um, same, same car. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so you're just up ahead of me at the moment. Yeah. And then this will be the end of that lap, approximately. Now, Rodas had a bad exit there, and I decided, oh, I need to have a go, because I'm not going to get many of these opportunities. But even then, he still starts pulling at the end of the straight, and obviously... With these rules, you're not allowed to dive. There's no dive bombing in this league, just to create clean racing. Yeah, so come on, I run wide and actually get a half a second penalty, which was ridiculous. <laughs> um, yeah. Running wide usually makes you slower, so... So I try to serve it into this corner here, but unfortunately, Medley turns in on us and half spins us, but... I mean, you got rid of your penalty at least. Yeah, so... Uh, Rigel yeah. goes in for the pit. And we caught right back up to Madley here. Is that the same lap? Looks like, like it. Uh, I don't Might know. Be. Oh, he gets um, a bit of oast there or something. Yeah, but he get, gets a pretty bad exit. And we get try to go along around the outside. Close battling there. Yeah trying to do some sort of switchback move but he just parked it um, really good and uh, try to find the next opportunity coming to the first corner done a wee bit of like a fake thing and he gets a big snap of oversteer and that oh. I, I almost followed him out off the track but yeah got yeah. him got him there uh, that was Jake going into the pit, so that's the first of the top four to go in. Another lap later, Taha and Rodas go in. I'm the last of the top four to stay on track. And at this point, I was like, okay, I may as well just use the left, the rest of my tyres, because I was still probably faster than them at that point. 
but new tires would have definitely benefited me. So that a lap later, I go into the pits, try not to accidentally cut the pit lane there, but they're all right. And my pit box was right here. Yeah, so I nearly forgot that, but good thing I made it in the right spot. Now, obviously, we, like I said at the start, we were going for a lower fuel load at the start, and we're going to add more fuel in our pit stop, so that's exactly what I'm doing here. I'm adding more fuel than probably the other cars, and so I had a pretty long pit stop. Now Sam was behind me at this point, and you'll probably see him sneak through soon, because he had a quicker pit stop than I did. There's me. Hayden comes past. Yeah, it's his turn to pit. We've got a few more cars coming in now. I we forgot to. Get there. Yeah, forgot to speed this part up. But... Anyway, so yeah, there we go. Sam sneaks through. He's had a quicker pit stop than myself, and I get out behind him. Hayden's still there. And he'll be having a similar length pit stop to myself, so... Yeah, that wasn't the best... Um, it hasn't worked out the best for us so far. I come out behind Evil. So at this point, I'm not exactly sure what position I'm in. But I've dropped down a little bit. There's a few cars that haven't pitted still. So, yeah, we'll see what happens there. This is Hayden entering the pits. Yeah, so they have a really weird pit entry. I guess it slows you down. Um... Yeah, so we yeah, are was. 17 litres to be added. Doesn't seem like a, like much, but it's um, Seems to make a difference here. Yeah. Um, and then there, we went, or well, myself and Sam went out. There's Rodders behind you. Yeah, I was speaking of Rodders. Uh, on, he, he went in the pits a lap before me, but he missed his pit box. So we went out for another lap and then came in on the, that lap. So he had uh, he had effectively two pit stops. One was a drive-through though, so that was unfortunate for him. Then Hayden comes out and he's in clean air, so that's not too bad. Yeah, P10 um, behind FX UK, and um, yeah, it looks like someone's going to the pits. I think that was FX because he got a penalty, a drive-through yeah, penalty, so. So I'd have, I decided catching up to Evil from after coming out the pits, and I was getting close, and I wanted to get through. So obviously I'm gonna start attacking, and I go alongside him here, um, battling Mercedes Power on the straight. He starts pulling ahead. I try to go as deep as I can. There's a little bit of contact, which sort of hurt my exit, but not by. I had a decent exit. Get alongside him again, but once again his Mercedes Power just takes over and keeps him in front. So that overtaking move wasn't meant for this lap. Hopefully I'll get him again soon. Now this is about a lap later, in the same corners. Try to get a nice exit here. Go straight to the middle. I get in that slipstream, try to get as much speed as I can. Now around here, he brakes earlier than I'd, ex than I'd usually break, and I wasn't expecting it, and so I, I tried to be good and avoid him, and I did just that. Went off the track though, losing a lot of time. Coming back onto the track, obviously. Nailed this a little bit too much, put me onto the other side. I'm glad I didn't end up completely spinning it though. Now this is a good few laps later after trying to get back up to him and I managed to do so. Same same corners and I make sure to stick it this time. I get just enough alongside him to hold it there. And I think that was enough to keep me in front. So that, that was a bit frustrating. Probably a bit my fault going off the track there. I wasn't uh, anticipating where he's going to break. Uh, so we're back onto me. Just saw Madly, he had uh, received a drive through penalty, he's just ahead of us, so that's another free position for us, so that's, we're technically in 8th now, um, and yeah. then Rigel is 17, or well now 18 seconds ahead. I noticed throughout the laps that I wasn't getting any closer, uh, he actually managed Ooh. to get past the next guy, that's uh, Crew going, a bit of oversteer going off. Back to me. And yeah, this is, is your this... last lap. Yeah, so this is my last lap, coming into the last straight, and there's Sam in the distance. So I was eventually catching him, but it was just not enough. If it wasn't for that um, off track I had, I might have been a lot closer. Um, but yeah, it just didn't happen that time. This is Hayden's finish. Yeah, you gotta do the traditional handbrake turn. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so this video is probably quite a lot shorter than our other ones. There just wasn't as much action, but it was still a fun race. 
Yeah, so this is the final um, championship results. Uh, so we got uh, Brandon in fifth and me in seventh. It's not so too bad. You did pretty well to get up there with it, with, even with uh, missing three races. Yeah, I think we did drop two races in the end, everyone. Yeah. And this and is... Um, this, yeah, this is the next league that's starting up. Yeah, so we've got another league, the second season of this GT3 league starting on the 30th of March. Uh, we're going to be taking part driving the Callaway Corvette and hopefully we'll do well with that. And we're signing up as a team, so hopefully we'll get a lot of team points. Sweet. Join the Discord thanks. and we'll see you next time. Yeah, thanks for watching this and I hope you enjoy the second season. All right. I boy, think I boy. eventually qualified boy. second. You're breathing on the mic. How's it picking up my breathing? <laughs>